Well, hello and welcome back to another episode of the Fred Everest Challenge with me, Bomber Herald. When we left off, we just kicked off our first match of the season against Leicester, got absolutely panned, and I'm sorry to say that the season is carrying on much like that. We've been in an absolutely diabolical run of form recently. So, if we have a look, that's where we left off. We had a 4 0 defeat to Leicester. Um, things looked like they were picking up. We beat Manchester City 2 0. Then we won in the EFL Cup second round against Warsaw. Then beat Swansea 3 1. And I thought that this was going to be one of those fantastic saves I'd enjoy. Oh, how wrong was I? From Swansea. We've only won one more match, so that was 27th of August. We didn't then win until the 14th of December, so look at some of these horror shows. 3-0 drubbing by Stoke, a 1-1 draw against Bournemouth, Stoke knocks us out of the cup, beat 3-0 by Manchester United, 2-0 by Palace, 1-0 by Hull, 0-0 with Watford. I mean, we struggled to score unbelievably. Someone like Solomon Ron, Rondon in the um, in the squad. I mean, his head was turned. PSG wanted him. We're letting him go, and this is the net result. Um, obviously, three-one defeat by Tottenham. We actually scored there. Then we've got a two-nil defeat. Then a couple of draws. Thought things were looking up. Then obviously two hard games. I was expecting to lose both those. Three-nil to Chelsea. One-nil to Liverpool. I mean, that was a good performance. That one. We were unlucky to lose. Finally got back to winning ways against Burnley, 4-2, and then the last two matches. 4-0 hammering at home to Southampton, and then a 3-0 drubbing to Arsenal. So today we're going to play the Boxing Day game against Middlesbrough. Now, I am looking at changing up the tactics. We've been playing a essentially a 4-5-1, um, or variants thereof. But, let's have a look at what this uses. But it's just clearly not working. It's not a formation that's working. So we're going to go to a more narrow formation of 4-3-1-2. Which I've had a lot of success with on, on this game and Football Manager 2016. Um, I don't care, it's been played out of position. Carry on. Now it's... Um, obviously... This quick pick thing is definitely not an auto win. I mean, it's it's a travesty what's happening here. It's we've still got Wilson being played at left back, um, who is 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 not he's not been doing well. We've got Brunt as a ball winning midfielder and Livermore as a cent central midfielder. I'd preferred to swap those round and Chadley's playing there. But we'll um, we'll we'll see how this goes. So let's get into the match. I don't know why I don't just tick that box not to show that anymore. It's um, it's superstition more than anything. We'll apply the advice. And let's assertively tell them we've got to have an improved performance. Let's get on with it then. Let's change this back to a... Oh, we're on 2D Classic already, aren't we? Yeah. So, I mean, the problem we've been having is we just don't seem to have the creativity up front. I mean, as Middlesbrough come through, I mean, they're, they're ahead already. It's going to be another drubbing. Another drubbing, but we just don't have any creativity. I mean, how will it last four to six seasons? I don't, I don't think I'm going to last one here. I expect to see that's showing from you. Oh, let me switch off. That's been your problem all season, mate. Let's see if we can go control. Let's see if that brings us any luck. Wilson out there, the Fantastic left back, even though we've got a really experienced left back in the squad. Chadley, Undon, Brunt, to Wilson, Dunn to Livermore, to Morrison, to Livermore, to Ruben. That would have been a good team goal. Brunt. I mean, we're keeping hold of the ball 
better than we were on the previous tactics. Ruben, to Solomon Rondon, 1-1. One, one. Only seventh of the season, and that's, that's the problem we've been having. He's not been able to play as a lone striker, but now with a striking partner, maybe it's a lot of fortune to that goal. But I'll take it. Let's just have a drink of my tea. Let's carry on. I mean, a draw would be okay, but we need to be winning. Let's see if we can make any changes. Right. So mental. Craig Dawson and I get Callum Patterson on. Throw him on as well. And I don't think we need to make three changes. Let's not get hysterical yet. We'll actually we'll bring Hal Robson Kenny on. Can you play as a poke chair? Just about. Headley. Yes! Lee Chung Young finally delivers. Finally. Oh, come on. That's a Chad Lee. That is a great ball. And I mean, that is a tidy finish for your first goal of the season. Brilliant. Let's go contain for the last two minutes so we can see this out. Yes, and that is a good that is a good victory. So I think we'll stick with that that tactic now. Let's praise the lads because they did really well. Absolutely dominant throughout the match. So very pleased with that. So we'll go away now. We've got the January transfer window approaching, so we'll play up to there. Um, actually, we'll go through to the deadline. Look at that. Man City thrashed 7-1 by Liverpool. Reno bagged 4. Good grief. Let's see how the table looks for now. Um, so, we're 18th. Hopefully, we can put put a um, run together, minus 21 goal difference, we've been getting absolutely battered recently, um, I mean it's not as embarrassing as Man City, but there we go, so I'll go away, we'll play, and I'll play up to the deadline, so come back between these two games, have a look at the players that we've signed, and hopefully we'll um, have a few wins there. After the after the transfer window, we'll come back and it'll be the final game of the season against Arsenal to finish off season one. So for me, until next time, obviously if you do like if you do like these videos, please drop a like, comment, and share. Um, obviously, a subscription would be very welcomed indeed. If you if I'm doing anything that you think I should be doing differently, let me know in the comments. Obviously, as as always. But until next time, see you later.